welcome to my channel. Today we are going to do something in this little oh, glass. I found this one on eBay or AliExpress and I actually designed it in uh, Fusion 360 for download as a print file in resin, translucent resin. For this one I am going to use my dessert topping master. I have a milk, a strawberry and a chocolate. And I'm using all these small fruit pieces and chocolate fruit pieces and stuff like that that I made a long time ago. I also have this little cane here that is rolled out in a light brown colored clay and then uh, colored on the outside with pastel. And I'm going to cut these into tiny, tiny slices and cutting the slices into small pieces for some chopped nuts that you can put on top of these small desserts that we are going to make. In my info box below you will find a link to the 3D print file for the little uh, glass bowl and you will also find a link for my playlist with all my canes so you can see how I made all the canes that is used for this project. The dessert topping master that I'm using here, this is the milk, are found on eBay and uh, the dessert topping master icing and sauce that I'm going to use later are also found on eBay. Um, so you will have to look for it. I'm just filling these small jars half the way up with uh, first of all the white here and then I am changing into the chocolate here. I'm filling the last two of these halfway up with my chocolate. The little tip here is um, coming with the uh, dessert topping master so you don't have to look for it. It's with when you get it. I wanted some piece of fruit on the sides of the jaws here so I'm placing my strawberries. Sorry I was a bit out of frame but I'm kind of placing them all the way around here on the dessert. And when I'm done with that, with the ones of uh, these that I want to do this on, I am going to let them dry fully, which is taking around a few hours. So here are my dessert topping masters. This is an icing. The other four is a sauce and I'm going to use these to make kind of a small edge around here uh, at the little jar so that it looks like there is something else in there, maybe some lemon curd or something like that. So I'm doing this on all of these with the different colors that I have here. I'm trying not to fill too much of this in there just so that you have this uh, edge all the way around. I actually put a little too much in this one. And I'm just gonna do this with all of these one by one uh, using all my colors to make a lot of interesting desserts. When I filled them all with this I am going to leave that to dry and that again takes around an hour. When that all has dried, I am going back to my dessert topping master. This is a, a strawberry I'm using here. Uh, and I am just going to fill up one of these small jars here. Just fill it up, give it a really nice top here. And then I am going to decorate it. If you have a little spoon, you can put that in. You can put some strawberries on, you can put some chocolate pieces, oranges, or whatever you really like here. Just decorate it just like you feel like. And don't forget the little uh, chopped nuts that we uh, made as well, because that actually can uh, make a big difference on these small desserts.
When you are all done decorating these small desserts, then you just go ahead and wait for it all to dry before you can uh, use these in your dollhouse or uh, whatever project you are working with. That's all there is for today. I had a lot of fun with these. These are easy and you don't have to bake them. Um, I hope you can find this uh, dessert topping master because it is really easy to use and you will very fast get some very nice desserts and some decorations on cookies and stuff like that with this product. So I will see if I can find a link for it and leave it in the info box below. That's all for today, so thank you for watching and bye!